Hi there, this is John and welcome to another video demo. I have this rather nice uh, photograph of a English bluebell wood open in the expert mode of Photoshop Elements and I would like to put a frame around it and if we go to the bottom right and click on the graphics tab um, we can see that we have lots of different backgrounds and frames and we can select from the drop-down menu the type we want. I've got this set to frames and I'm going to scroll down and choose a particular frame to, to suit this image. And this, this is one I've already downloaded. You can see it doesn't have a blue corner so it means it's available locally. The ones with the blue corners take a few seconds to download. So just double click and the frame gets added automatically. Now we can use this uh, slider here um, in the frame before committing but that just adjusts the photo size within the actual frame so it kind of zooms in and out and you can adjust accordingly. But some people have asked how can I actually change the size of the frame? So I'm going to move back now to the layers panel and you can see that we have um, the actual photo, uh, a mask and a background and there is the frame on top of everything and then it's all contained within a group. Um, this one is labelled D said Mother's Day which is the name of the frame and if we select that group layer we can actually um, amend the size of everything within the group. So what I'm going to do first is make myself some more space by going to the top menu image and I'm going to click on resize image size and I'm going to add 5 inches to the to the width making it 18 and 5 inches to the height making it 17 and click OK and um, as you can see that gives me um, a lot more space so let's just fit it within the within the uh, window so what we can do now is we can drag the corner handles to use more of that space and I recommend you hold down the shift key because that helps to ensure the proportions of the original image are retained and the, the, the whole thing doesn't get distorted. So holding down the shift key I'm going to drag out and use some of this extra canvas that I've created and there we have it. Just a quick way to enlarge the, the photo frame and you can save it now as a PSD file if you want to retain all the layers if you think you may want to go back and amend it um, or you can um, save it straight away as a JPEG. So I hope you like this quick tip how to resize your frames in Photoshop Elements. Thanks for watching, bye for now.